Lesson with EverydayShortcuts.com. Welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be making one of my most popular recipes on my blog. Um, it is the Copycat Starbucks Pink Drink. This is one of my absolute favorite drinks to make of all time. And I really just hate paying like four or five bucks at Starbucks. So I'm going to show you how to, you can make one at home for much less. So my recipe is slightly different than how Starbucks makes theirs. I'm not a huge fan of heavy whipping cream. So my recipe has a lighter amount of heavy whipping cream in it. It still tastes the same and just as delicious as Starbucks makes theirs. It's also lower in carbs and keto friendly if you're following a keto diet. So let's get started in making this copycat Starbucks pink drink. So what you need is 10 ounces of boiling water, heavy whipping cream, Starbucks passion fruit tea, sugar free vanilla syrup, and Jordan Skinny Syrup is my absolute favorite um, vanilla syrup to use. It has no calories, no carbs, no sugar, and so delicious. And if you want to check it out for yourself, I will leave a link and a discount code. And you can use fresh strawberries or freeze-dried strawberries if you'd like, um, just to kind of garnish and add a little bit more flavor and ice and I like to put mine in a Starbucks cup this is just like a plastic cup that they sell and that way it seems like you are drinking it from Starbucks but you are actually saving money making it at home okay so let's get started in making this the first thing you want to do is boil 10 ounces of water in the microwave I usually just add it to a measuring cup and then you want to add one passion fruit tea bag to the boiling water and steep it for five minutes. And while that is getting ready, you want to prepare your cup and you want to add ice halfway to the cup. And then you're going to add one pump of the sugar free vanilla syrup to the cup. And once the five minutes is up on steeping your tea, you can go ahead and pour it in. And then add 10 milliliters of heavy whipping cream. And to measure it out, I just use like a medicine cup. It just makes it easier. And you can just dump it in there. And if you want, you can add more ice if you wish. And then just stir. And sometimes the ice does melt, so you may need to add a bit more. Just kind of mix it all together. And then you can add some fresh strawberries. or even freeze-dried strawberries if you'd like, and enjoy.